Thanks for joining me for another video beer review. This time we've got a can of beer from Nov Monk Bruco in Leeds. It's a can of their New World IPA, 6.2% ABV, Indy Pale Ale. So, this first ever beer, what was reduced, uh, produced by um, Nov Monk was this. It's been through many uh, versions since then. Really interesting to see what the can version is like. I'm not going to pour it all because, as I said, I'm going to, under a couple of reviews, I'm going to do a bit of a blend. I'm going to make braggots. Um, so, I'm going to use this in one of my braggot blends. So, beer in the glass. Absolutely pin, pin bright. Perfect golden beer. Off my head. Let's give it a swirl and sniff. Check out the aroma. That's nice. That's lovely. Fresh pine, big pine, unripened pineapple. Oh yeah, that's nice. Loads of grapefruit flesh. Slightly, slight hint of sandstone. Take that for whatever you want. There's a certain minerality and there's a, a, a cleanliness to it, I guess. That's, that's what I'm getting at. That's lovely. It's quite sharp, but kind of like slightly herbal as well. Maybe a hint of flat leaf parsley. Let's dive in. Cheers. Ooh, plenty of bitterness. It's very East Coast American kind of like style. It's very Yorkshire, it's very West Yorkshire, I'd say. <laughs> yeah, there's a big full whack of hot bite in there. Big pine, definitely kind of like burnt bread with uh, marmalade on it. It's quite intensely kind of like sharp citrus, I'd say, like big earthy kind of like attack. It's definitely not that fruit bowl type of IPA. Bitter, slightly chalky, grapefruit, big time grapefruit, maybe a hint of melon, gooseberry, black tea, nettle, that kind of thing. It's nice. Mm. Yeah, I think they've done a really nice job with that. As I said, and this goes for a lot of IPA, especially in Britain. Um, one of the most recognised IPAs in the UK is Cannonball by Magic Rock. I was talking to my friend Steve over at um, the Beer Clock Show podcast. I said, "Have you got a memory? Do you know uh, that flavor? Have you got that flavor memory of what Cannonball tastes like?" And I said, "And he said, no, cause it changes it all that often." If you ask me about this beer, I'd say the exact same thing. I'm not sure what this beer actually tastes like until I taste it, and, I, and, I, and most of the time, I'd say 80% of the time, I really do enjoy it. But I think this is just another of those kind of experiences. It's different. It's different again. But, but I guess that's um, a relatively young brewery. Still finding the feet, still trying to perfect the IPA, and there's no problem with that, especially when they do it to this quality. Big hop onslaught, good amount of bitterness. It's not crushing, doesn't linger, not too dry, not too sweet. I think they've just they've done a, re a real nice job on this. So that is a can of New World IPA from Northern Monk in Leeds. Lovely stuff. I'm Rob from Hopzine.com. I'll see you next time. Cheers. Thank <laughs> you.